Welcome back to the DCC Concepts YouTube channel. Today I'm going to talk you through how to set your Cobalt Digital IP point motor to the address that you wish it to respond to on any DCC control system. The method is always the same and you should only follow this method when setting up your Cobalt IP digital points. Step 1 is to locate the set and run switch on the Cobalt point motor. This can be found on the circuit board that contains also the wire connection points. It is clearly marked with set and run. It is important to note that the point does not need to be removed from the layout in order to do this nor does it need to be connected to a programming track. The entire process is achieved with the point motor in situ on your layout. With the set and run switch moved to the set position, it's now time to take your DCC control unit and use it to access the accessory bus. Choose the number that you wish the point motor to respond to and then on your control system address this number as if the point is already assigned this. The point will not move in this process. The point has now learnt its new address. You need to change the switch from set to run. Finally, when you use your DCC controller to access the accessories, using the number that you have now assigned to this point will result in it changing. It's as simple as that. If you need any further information, we've got a link to the DCC Concepts website in the description box down below. 